Hey, welcome to Excel Magic Trick 1894. And in this video, we want to see how to create random dates using either the RAND between function or the RAND array function. To create random dates in Excel, we can use the RAND between function. We just need a bottom and a top. And guess what? We normally put numbers, but if we put dates in double quotes, it'll understand. I'm going to start at 1 slash 1 slash 2025 and double quote. That's the bottom, comma, quote, 12 slash 31 slash 2026 and double quote, close parentheses. And when I control enter, well, that's a serial number date, home we can apply date number formatting. There it is, short, click. There's the fill handle, hover. I see my crosshair or angry rabbit, click and drag. And there are randomized dates. Now, if I hit the F9 key, which is not working on my computer, so I have to do it the long way, formulas, calculations group, and there it is. Calculate, notice it says F9. On my computer, it's not working, so I'm gonna click and it will randomly create new dates. But almost always, we don't want them to randomize. So once we create them, then we need to copy and paste special values. And here's a great trick. Point to the edge of the highlighted area and don't left click, right click. Hold the click, drag to the side, drag back, and when you let go, a secret menu pops up Copy here as values only, and bam, I've created random dates. Now, what if you want to spill? Well, we don't use rand between, we use rand array. We need to tell it how many rows, five, comma, skip columns, the min, min date, in double quotes, comma, as text, whatever the upper date is. And let's check this out, control, enter. Well, it gave me five. If I change this to four, it is dynamically working. But you don't want to leave those decimals because if you format it, well, those decimals represent the proportion of a 24-hour day. So in the top cell, F2 to put it in edit mode. Backspace, I just need to comma. And for integer, I need true or one. And now close, control, enter. I get my dates. If I highlight this whole range, control one to open format cells, date, I can pick whatever date number formatting I want, click OK. Now, I want 10 rows, and bam, I am randomizing dates. All right, we'll see you next Excel magic trick. Wow.